hello guys so what's up and welcome back to another video this is a sign that i have been reading your comments i do i have not had time to reply all the comments but i do read your comments and i don't take them for granted you ask me to check out some places that may interest me and on the process i bumped into this okay so this is not something i originally wanted to do but it came and i said i can't resist now let's talk about tourism in ghana why is it so big truth is i am a big lover of nature and ghana has that to offer but there are places i have not been to in ghana and i'm seeing them online and it is mind-blowing and that is what i want us to take a look at today i hope you're ready if you have not subscribed kindly hit the subscription button ensure to turn on the bell notifications so that anytime i upload a video you'll be notified so i'm going to let you see some natural places in ghana that will blow your mind this is going to give you the answer to why stories are trooping in and out of Ghana on a daily basis. Let's go see. Die Nächte sind einsam. Der Himmel ist grau. Wer will schon allein sein? Dieses Gefühl kenne ich ganz genau. Bin zu oft gescheitert, hab so viel riskiert, doch der Moment ist da, es wird endlich wahr, ich kann nicht glauben, dass es passiert, ich hab mein Leben lang gewartet, hab schon nicht mehr daran geglaubt, hab den Moment zu sehen. now all right so the truth is i have been to some of these places but i could not bring you guys the videos like this guys because they have the equipment they have the phones i went there with a mobile phone with a mobile phone i don't know what i was thinking but first i want to say thank you to all of you that have been keeping up with me my nonsense like you guys you take all the videos that i shot on a mobile phone and you told me well done you are doing a good job but let's talk were you guys consoling me or you were being honest Aus dem Nebel heraus Bring dich wieder zurück nach Haus yeah. Lass uns den Schritt nach vorne gehen Zusammen in die richtige Richtung drehen Ich fühle dich sicher von Ost nach West Komm halt dich an mir fest now you can you can see how big ghana is on tourism and if you are a lover of nature ghana got you covered there is no negotiation about this almost every corner you go to in ghana there is something that will blow your mind that will make you cry Wer will schon allein sein? Dieses Gefühl kenn ich ganz genau. Bin zu oft gescheitert, hab so viel riskiert. Doch der Moment ist da, es wird endlich wahr. Ich kann nicht glauben, 
dass es passiert Ich hab mein Leben lang gewartet Hab schon nicht mehr daran gebraucht Hab den Moment zu sehr herbeigesehnt In dem du meinen Atem brauchst Einfach Hals über Kopf Hals über Kopf Yeah, the day I went to Kweu, right? Yeah, when I went to Kweu, I cried. Yeah, there's there's one other place I visited in Canada, I cried. Lake Bosomche. You know what? When you just look at everywhere being so beautiful, still, peaceful, calm, and it's just right there. It is not man-made. The man-made around these places is just to enhance the beauty of nature. I used to cry. Thank you very much. But now let's go take a look at this other place. I'm a lover of nature there are so many places like this in Ghana there's one place at the Volta region uh, Keta to be precise yeah I think I, I did a video what's their name Ab Aborigin yeah Aborigin oh my god like I am a lover of nature and this place see if you want to enjoy your life you have money <laughs> come to Ghana this is not about hyping this is about me giving you value for giving me your time to watch this video if you are looking for where to go to for holidays or honeymoon you just found love and you just got married or maybe you want to get to know her true color bring her to Ghana because she's gonna love it bring her to Ghana and propose she will not say no you get why i'm saying this because i know i'm a woman okay i'm giving you the expo bring her to ghana so she's not gonna say no to you okay do that and thank me later there's another one on the list let's go check it out Every region you go to in Ghana, there will be something for you. This country is blessed with natural beauty. Now, I'm talking about the landscaping, nature. Everywhere you go to, there's something for you. Places like Ibri Mountain. And the fun part about these places is the weather. The weather don't feel like you are in Ghana because it is so different, okay? The weather is different. Let me know if you like videos like this so I can bring you places that you could visit in Ghana at low cost. The thing about coming to Ghana is you don't have to worry about anything. The only thing you should worry about is money. And I believe money is not your problem. When I say money, I'm not talking about a huge amount of money. I'm talking about money that could be enough for you to enjoy yourself and go back. If you are looking for where to go on vacation, Ghana got to cover. There are so many, um, apart from the beautiful nature you see in Ghana, it's safe. Okay, it is super safe for any gender. Doesn't matter, it is safe for you. And nobody treats you a certain way. Okay, all you should be concerned about is make sure you have enough money for all of this. And that's all. People don't judge you, nobody treats you anyways, nobody cares about your skin color. 
you are welcome to Ghana. Okay. If you're coming to Ghana because of this video, comment down below. Okay. If you don't want me to know you are in town, don't worry. When you go back, thank me. All right. So this is just like an icing on the cake. These places I've shown you is just like icing on the cake. Ghana is beautiful and I am proud of one thing. No one has come here and not confirmed that this country is beautiful. All right. If you're a lover of nature, come to Ghana and thank me later. I hope that you enjoyed this video and that I will see you in my next one. Bye.